Welcome back to Tarot by the Bay. I'm David. It's Wednesday, June 7th. This will be a short reading for a short, a little reading for a little person. Uh, this is Taylor Budowicz, who is, um, who leads the Super PAC MAGA Incorporated. Apparently he testified to the Miami Grand Jury today. And after his testimony, he said today, and what can only be described as a bogus and deeply troubling, troubling effort to use the power of government to get Trump. I fulfilled my legal obligation to testify in front of a federal grand jury, and I answered every question honestly. Did you now? Does pleading the fifth uh, mean you answered them honestly, or did you actually give answers? Now, does this guy have a lot to, to share? Eh, maybe, maybe not. We'll find out. Um, I'm curious if his testimony will have much impact. Uh, again, stories were out there saying that some of this uh, grand jury in Florida was to be for some convenience in people in Florida, maybe also to tie up loose ends. And this might be a, a, a person that ties up loose ends. Um, yeah, so, yeah, <laughs> I love his quote, though, because, you know, it's a, the government's getting Trump and it's bogus and deeply troubling. God. <laughs> did did Trump write you tell you what to say because or are you just that good at imi imitating the boss? Okay, entertainment purposes only. Did uh, what's that? I already forgot the Taylor. Is that this guy's name? Yeah. Did was his testimony of any consequence in the Mar-a-Lago documents case? Find out. Maybe there's going to be something here. Maybe not. Right. Uh, okay. Well, these cards are upside down. Yeah. Um, there we go. So it's he. This is showing that he's leading the super PAC. So here's all the money that he uh, that he controls as part of the MAGA super PAC. And there's the King of Cups. So the super PAC ostensibly is to defeat Joe Biden and you know get Trump back in there. So here we go. Super PAC crossed with uh joe biden so basically yeah, it's, it's just a re-election fund that he's doing i don't know if i would necessarily consider him the, the mature emotionally mature male but whatever maybe the king of cups will reveal itself in the past hostage um yeah i can imagine given how he's testified uh in in the in the uh what he said his testimony in the article uh that Take two, Q David, action. Given his quote in the article about this being basically a witch hunt organization, yeah, he's hostage all right. He's hostage to Trump. He basically has to do everything Trump tells him, even though he leads that super PAC. He was a former aide of Trump. So, you know, he's he's willingly tied himself to this guy. Uh, here's the Knight of Swords. I've used this card to... Uh, this card to me represents Jack Smith and him pursuing charges, including treason charges. So this, his testimony was part of this case. Was it of any consequence? Possibly. Let's see. You know what? This card is probably also, he, he was compelled to testify. He had to testify. He didn't want to. He had to. He had to do his legal obligation. Jack Smith is running with it. Oh, dear. Okay, star card. Now, in a previous reading, I was saying if the star card came up with regards to this, that's probably Mark Meadows. I don't think this guy is the star witness. It just doesn't seem likely, but I think it he's tied into Mark Meadows. This is going to be basically his testimony is corroborating some stuff that Meadows said. And again, this is a super PAC, so there's all sorts of money involved in this. And if there's one thing we know about Donald Trump is he likes money. He likes money a lot. He'd make Mr. Krabs blush with his desire for money. The lesson to be learned. <sighs> well, you know, sometimes you're welcome. Sometimes you're told to not let the door hit you on the butt on the way out. Lesson to be learned is, you know, you have a choice whether you join the party or you leave the party. And in this one, you were obligated to testify to Jack Smith in his case regarding Mark Meadows' testimony. So you can either testify and not go to prison or you can be obstinate, in which case they'll be looking for you. 
But, you know, I think he did testify. And he's going to start implicating the Republican Party. He himself will probably be okay, but the Republican Party won't be. Because there's Jack Smith, again, as the King of Swords underneath it. So, in the end of the day, he had to testify about the Super PAC involving their re-election against Joe Biden. Jack Smith is there the whole time, requiring that testimony. This dude felt trapped. He had to testify, even though he didn't want to. It forwards Jack Smith's case against Trump. It's going to corroborate some of the stuff Mark Meadows said. Uh, you know, he had to do it to save himself or else he was going to be welcomed behind bars. And it's going to implicate the Republicans. Okay, that's my little six-minute hit on this dude. Um, congratulations, play stupid games, win stupid prizes. I really wonder if there's any financial stuff going on there, too, that might lead to an investigation like that. Okay, but anyways, thank you for supporting my channel. Thank you for watching this video. I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.